There's no place to escape to. This is the last stream. On the left. <laughs> That's when the cannibalism started. Don't laugh, you fucking pigs! They tried to stop the Tonight Show. They tried to stop it. They? Who is they? You saw. You saw. What? When the G-Men came. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Rob laid his life down to be riddled with bullets. Mm. He will be missed. I will miss him, but you know what? Who? God damn, I'm proud of him. <laughs> and what he did. Because tonight, stop laughing. Tonight's an extremely serious night. Because we're back here again. You know, I'm being forced to do this by forces outside of my control. To meet you halfway in the world of truth. It's a mysterious labyrinth of mirrors because there are lies. But even within a lie, you can find a truth if you look hard enough. Just let me know when I'm supposed to start listening. <laughs> <laughs> so is, so we're meeting them halfway to the truth with a lie? Sometimes a lie is more true than truth. But sometimes the truth gets covered by a lie, doesn't it? But tonight, we're going to look at both. Truth, lies, deceptions, honesties, revelations, smoke screens. Welcome to a very, very serious UFO mandate. It's helmed by me, MUFON officer Henry Zabrowski. I thought you said they were a bunch of bullshit. I know. I got actually need a new shirt. I need a new, I need a yeah, new I thought, representation. Yeah, I thought one of them, I thought the head went to prison for trying to buy a boy online. No, you don't go to prison for trying anything. You, you got to do it. No, 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 no but you, you can. Yeah, if you try to like shoot up some people, you go to prison. John Hinckley Jr. went to prison for a lot of years for trying to kill the president. I know, but he and Mental again, hospital. That, no, again, and now he's a victim of cancel culture. And the same thing happens to us, doesn't it? Because mm. we survive one tribulation and we have to move on to the next, don't we? Yep. Last time I had cancel cultures, I told them not to put butter. On my baked potato. That doesn't make any sense. Cancel the culture. I actually don't <laughs> understand. Butter. <laughs> I, 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 I think culture. That would be more. But that would be more like a yogurt. yogurt. Oh, yogurt. Yeah, yogurt. Oh, yeah. Well, um, just strawberries for me. Though. You're a moron. You're too skinny to live. I'm a genius. <laughs> Tonight's going to be very, very important because mm -hmm. what I wanted to do tonight was a little preview into what we might be doing at Contact in the Desert. So at this UFO conference in Los Angeles, in the Los Angeles area, I will be hosting what's called a very serious look at UFOs, hosted by us. And I think what's really important is to dial in what is a UAP and what is definitely not a UAP. Okay. Because hmm. I think there's a lot of confusion. You guys were not impressed by jellyfish last week. Not in the least. Because no, it was a long you, time are, ago. you are both. <laughs> yes, I don't know when it was. But months ago but when it happened you weren't into it because it because it's you bullshit. have no taste yeah, it looks like shit. you yeah. just don't know uh two tone the comic book store closes at five sir yes <laughs> yes we will get there yes 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 people are saying they're ready to see me get picked on i don't think yeah. that's going to happen today because i think some of the footage i have today is the most compelling footage i have ever accumulated for one of these wow. so we'll see they say here big herb asks, what's the salute for a mufon officer i'll tell you what uh i'm not a cop you know what I mean? Like, I, I, I'm, not, yeah. I'm not quite certain. I'm not quite certain. But tonight, I'm going to show you first videos. I'm going to show you a video that is a UAP. It's very compelling and very interesting. Or other compelling footage, because I have some stuff in here that will go undisclosed. That some of it's not just UFO footage. Some of it's other very interesting stuff. And then I'm going to show you guys a video that is definitely not UAP. So that you know... The exact difference between what is UAP mm -hmm. and what is not. Because we got a lot of people out there crying balloon. And to you ballooners out there, I say, I'm going to call the ACLU on you. Isn't a balloon, if you don't know if it's a balloon or not, and you don't know where the balloon came from, wouldn't it still be a UAP? I'm starting to work on you. 
That's what that's showing. That's what that thought is. I would think that that's that, a thought that taught you something. I taught you something. I would think that that argument would go against what you believe. No. You ape me, man. <laughs> That doesn't make any sense. In UAP. All right, let's show yeah, this. Yeah. Now, let's just start. We're going to be there. UAP, Unidentified Aerial Phenomena, amigo. Okay, that is what it's called. It's a new name. Mm-hmm. All right, it's not UFOs anymore. UFOs are for cucks. So your shirt means nothing? I just need... I'm going to have a new uniform yeah. soon. The mutual UFO. It's I'm UFO have a uniform is on soon. your shirt twice. I spent too much money for this polo to not have it on. Hey, that's right. You had to buy it twice because... 300, you... It's $600. I gave MUFON a total of $600. Okay? And it's over. All right? That relationship is over. I have cut them off. I'm not your fucking baby daddy anymore. Are they going to be at the contact? Yes. Wow. <laughs> that's a part yeah. of it. That's why, man, there's going to be big fucking throwdowns happening oh, in Contact the, in the Desert. Contact in the Desert actually reached out to me personally and said that I can make fun of you. I love that. Perfect. Excuse man. Because guess what? You're not going to fucking do. All right? Because best come for me. If you come for me, anybody out there, right? Especially Contact in the Desert. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you fucking sitting there waiting to see if I'm going to be caught snoozing on a dime. <laughs> but I ain't. All right, and if you come for me, you best not fucking miss. Because guess who comes after me? This fucking big monkey. All right? It does take me longer to come. Because guess what? It does. <laughs> His wife sometimes calls me in the middle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, here we go. Now let's watch some of this very, very compelling footage. This is number one. I have a lot of stuff here. Now, this was filmed outside of Philadelphia, not several days ago. Pennsylvania? No, the fever. (laughs) Philadelphia fever. I knew he couldn't control himself. (laughs) Now, there are some people that say that this is an LED kite. Now, I do have, I did look at some examples of an LED kite. It does not look like this, because you will see. It's very odd behavior. Yes, right now, it looks like some form of neon dildo-like snake. Yeah, very LED-like. It is very LED-like. Oh, yeah. It is... Let me zoom in on it right now. It's not quite there. The thing that changes, and we might need it, because this is an eight-minute long video. So we might need to jump... Can we fast forward? Forward a little bit. Now, watch this. Now, this this is a weird thing. The thing that makes this truly, truly strange, whatever this is. Yes, turn the screen brightness up, guys. Yeah. This is a good thing. Plug in your laptop. If you're at home, plug in your laptop. Turn up the screen brightness, all right? This ain't a time. It's very, this is not time for you to not. It's very vaginal. Yeah, why are there birds at night? That's Dusk. a good question. Dusk? Yeah, the birds wouldn't be... Birds don't sleep. Plus, <laughs> like but I never, you don't hear them tweet like this at night. I feel I like heard that's birds the worst t- part heard, of this. I hear birds tweeting at night all day, yeah. every day. And at dusk, there's, they're still going the, pretty hard. The, uh, Onion John, happy birthday. Thank you for this. I'm glad you're here. See, now watch. Dusk. Okay, so w- the thing that is really strange is you want to go a little dawn. bit more forward. I want to find. All right, here we go. It is going down. This is what's really fucking weird. So this squiggly bright thing that no one can yet identify. Because if you look at LED kites, they look like kites. Yeah. They look like triangles, and they have like some some of the things. Hang on. This is what's fucking weird. Whatever that shit is going to touch the water like this. Okay. Right, it goes all the way into the water like it's anal beads. Right, mm-hmm. it is not unlike anal beads sent from Jesus Christ. But oh, why the living fuck is it doing this? Yeah, this is crazy. fucking crazy, weird. Man. This is why it's like, why? What okay, the hell is this thing? That is strange. Right? It is strange. This is compelling footage. Yeah, is, I'm, I did better this time. Yeah, because it doesn't move like it's attached to a drone no. or anything. Because you could say one could say that. You know, you have uh, just a string of LED lights yes. attached to a drone, and then it just and it goes in and out, dips in and dips out. <laughs> Racy Anthony yeah. says the reflection in the water is kind of wild. Yes, yeah, yeah it is. Mm-hmm. Now this is pretty. I like this because again, it's going, it's dipping in and out, and they don't know like wh- what the fuck is this thing. It's it might be it. one of the things that I'm going to show you that is being called not UAP. So who knows? But you know what the that weirdest thing part about the part it is what. Is that if it is aliens, 
I still don't give a fuck. Exactly. Sure. Yeah, see, that's the problem. Sure. That's been the problem sure. for the I'm last not, few years now. Is that, like, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm yeah. not saying you're wrong. Do I feel that this is the best example of what they should be doing with their trillions of year old technology? I don't know. I don't want to do So that's it. Keep it that. That's why that looks like is, that, is that it going back up into yes. the air? That's not That's, real. That, that now is, it looks not real. That is a plane. The that plane a, was too close. It's just literally, it is very whatever. Now it all looks is, fake. The, they should have not added the plane. No, it's, they didn't add the plane. It literally <laughs> just went by. They didn't like, add it. They <laughs> added it. Yes, no, but it's very, very interesting. Yes. Oh, yes. Plop says, if I've learned anything from Kate Middleton, this very blurry resolution is totally normal for 2024. Kate Middleton is dead. And she is currently a clone. Whoever's out there is currently a clone, and it is a mixture of, um, and it's got nothing to do with any one of her family members. I want to say that she is a, she's Laura Dern, but multi multiplicity cloned. So she's the dumb one. We have this next one here. Is that I want to make no sense. It doesn't matter, man. <laughs> All right, Lindsay Necropolis <laughs> was staring so hard at the screen. I tried to drink my bong instead of my water with the straw. That's how you get in the proper mindset. Yeah, yeah, uh, I agree proper with. mindset. So that is an example of UAP, unidentified aerial phenomena. Whatever you want to say about whatever that fucking thing is, we didn't know what it was, mm -hmm. right? But it's weird. As all fucking hell. Yeah, we we weird. Now this next video is definitely not UAP. Just so you know, we're going to set the standard for what is not UAP. All right. <laughs> now, if you yeah. notice, this is a drawn animation uh -huh. of a topless uh, cat girl shitting uh -huh. into a diaper. Uh -huh. Man, these kids today, dude, they fucking think they could be anything. That yeah. is not... UFO footage, and so I, and I can see because it's uh, it's identified. It's identified. We know, we know exactly what that what is. is. Mm -hmm. We know that it's a high school of furries. Yeah. So they are teenage uh -huh. furry children, and a part of what they do is encourage each other to fill their diapers with excrement. I don't know if it was encouragement. I think it was more. He a said, "Good girl." Yeah, I know, but was, I think it was more of a humiliation type thing. It didn't look like the. Let's see it again. I feel like, like she, let's see when it again. He said I don't, good girl to me. That but makes it no, because they're all look at how like horrified they look. Well, the girl's not enjoying it. And look, but and she I think might he's, be. What's he holding in his hand though? Oh yeah. Oh, kitty. It, is it weed? I think it's kitty. It, oh, it's, it's catnip. Kitty. It's catnip. catnip. Yeah. It's so kitty she's nip. doing it for catnip. She's filling her diaper for the internet for catnip. Oh, so he's so. a drug dealer. Yes, but uh. also likes to film her pooping. And that's, again, not a UAP. Not Doesn't matter. And not aerial. Not aerial Not aerial. In fact, it, one could argue that it's going down to the ground. It's descending. Um, General Hag says, don't you remember Betty and Barney Hill? They did see some of this on the UFO. Yes, there was some furry scat play in their scenario, but a lot of it was left out of the movie. However, would you consider that phenomena? Oh, yes. That? It's a phenomena. <laughs> Not Kids. phenomenal. It's not phenomenal. No, but it is a phenomenon. So got, one out of three. Like a lot of stuff here, guys. I got a lot of fucking show here. Don't, don't fucking look at it. <laughs> Do you fucking look at it. Now, so again, so now we've set the tone. UAP, not UAP. This next one okay. is considered another piece of one of the most compelling UFO footage. UAP piece of UAP, UAP footage. It's been on the internet. This next one's fucking awesome. It was filmed over Salida, I believe it's Colorado, in 95. Oh. And this thing's got some junk in the trunk. Hmm. Take a look at this one. Do you think, did they add a plane to it? Huh? Shut up. It's not adding. You're wrong. You're wrong. Does spaceship grow bigger like that? Let me see. The guy's calling this. The kid, little kid going, Spaceship, I thought I saw a spaceship, daddy. I thought I saw a spaceship. Right, so first of all, it's like, shut the fuck up. Shut the living fuck up. I'm trying to focus. Now, this thing right now, as you can see, it's going to do a little thing. Melissa Z said, my family are unwilling participants in tonight's stream. I'm sorry, your family is weak. Are there gunshots in the background? Maybe. Now, yes, people are shooting. I think they might literally be shooting bullets at it. Look at this thing. As it spins... Like, well, they did add a plane to it. It's back <laughs> noise. It's background noise. This one's good. <laughs> Fucking idiots always adding planes to shit. <laughs> Nico says looks like a cloud. That's because you got glaucoma. I'm sorry for your loss. You'll soon be blind. You'll soon be blind, Nico. Mm -hmm. So what's um? Yeah, this what's, is worse. Yeah, the, the, this well, is it's far it's, worse. it's building up. Okay. 
It's getting, once you, he really, because he he puts the binoculars over his phone. Oh. Well, it's not a phone. It's 95. Yeah. So it's an actual VHS recorder. Look at this. So you're seeing this thing. It's it's very it could fucking be a smudge solid. on the lens. No, but like, there's good angle of this. Which is coming when? Oh, yeah. The moon was this. out today during the day, and that seemed like... Are you there's not going to be playing in everyone, Danny Ray, but also it shows... This is where, as it gets clearer, Jesus, yes, man, you know, it's not, yeah, no, this thing's it's weird because it's a spinning That's disc. Still. Like How as can you see, you tell? it actually does have heft to it. If you were looking, you see it in the smaller screen, you can see that it's actually got a, a it's a, got a solid line around it. This thing is like a weird ass spinning disc. Like a ball going around it. I mean, way out around it, you know. No, yeah, no, it's like moving. Like it's shooting lens off from it. It's getting there. It's getting there. Where's the fucking... Oh. It just looks like a bug. Well, this is just bad frame rate. Where is it at? It's coming oh, in. Look at it. It's just amazing. Should I skip ahead a little bit? Yeah, Go skip ahead, too, because there's, thing, there's skip more ahead. resolution. Look at. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, yeah. Now we're getting... That. It just go back! This thing is honestly, you gotta watch it on a laptop. It's very, very thick. It's spinning. It's a Everyone disc that is, is spinning. watching it on a laptop. You are not, Whoa. though. You are not. <laughs> this is bigger. What is it? Yeah, worth watching it is far higher. Yes, the Google, the good angle is when you get four pixels instead of three. Yes, it's a fair. It's sweet. What, what, kind of, what kind of UAP is this? It's a it's a disc. Disc? It's literally got. If you saw it on a lap in a smaller frame, if you could see, you could actually see that it's if spinning. If I had to squint. Yeah, if you, yeah, if you horse. Go. Whatever, man. If I, so, if I was oh, high on my toilet. Yes. Okay. Matter of a second. There we go. It's a more. That's a clearer line. The they are firing guns at it. Yes, <laughs> they are firing guns at it. See a big one. See it going? Do you see it? I love it. Like, it even though there is a UFO or UAP. The guys firing guns can't be got bothered. <laughs> yeah, he literally could not <laughs> care less. <laughs> I get two hours a week. This is my time. All right? I will present my rage to Joseph Hussein Biden. <laughs> <laughs> I did not take this. This was not while I was taking a 3 a.m. dump. This was not Big Herb. All right, let's watch this next one. All right, because this one. So this was good, but I still think that, that was really good. I still think it was very good. If you watch it closely, this is, the, you want it more physical. You want it no jellyfish, because you guys can't handle it, even though I got several that, emails explaining why the jellyfish were actually very So far, we got a glare and a cloud. You just were incorrect. <laughs> you just are always like this. <laughs> we're guys, this is the, the stream of people watching someone show their vacation videos. Welcome to a super serious mandate. Maybe you're wrong. Maybe the court's wrong. Now, this next one I actually included. This is a ghost video. This is a ghost video. I included one because, honestly, this is pretty fucking creepy. This is not a UAP. This is not UAP. This is a ghost video. I just said this. Okay. This was sent by a fan, and this is, it's just really, really great. So they said these were, these were guys that were, they were fucking around with their, like, they were, like, hanging out. When, and they're, they're obviously, like, visibly intoxicated. But as you will see, there is somebody that is, that was not present when that video was shot. It's really weird. All right, let's take a look at it. This one is just, I just like this one. This one is just. Go! You see that oh, thing moving that you literally yeah. moved right there? It was not, they were, said they, were, they were the only ones home. So we're like, look at this there again. There was someone if, else there. Yes. But Go! I think it's more logical that someone's peeping on these chicks. Oh, see, that's got fucking got weird. That's Ooh, really it was like a child. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Yes, that one's weird. Oh, Whoa, gonna, can we gonna. pause it? Henry, tell my mom that you know what you saw. I haven't seen anything today. Bring it back a little bit. I want to see this. Ooh. Wow. It's really weird. They're wearing like a little dress. Yes, yeah. like a weird little like orphan like dress. Like a night dress, like a nighttime yes. outfit. Bring this is very, oh, very you creepy. You almost got it. You almost got it. I saw something. Wow. Now exactly. It, those if a fans? ghost is floating, it's a UAP. Unidentified check. Aerial check. Phenomenon check. Thank you, Greasy Strangler. Hmm. But, I just thought it was cool. So I just thought it, I didn't know what other forum in which to show That's it. incredible, actually. Yeah. That was really cool. Yeah, yeah it's really unless creepy. They're, was, unless they're hoaxing us. Would you hope you're not hoaxing us? I hope you're not hoaxing us. 
So hold on, is that What's not something that was found online that was sent in? That was sent in by a listener. Whoa. Did they say what what exactly they were doing when they were uh, shooting that video? Seems like they're about to play beer pong. For some context, this girl is a very sweet person and is nice, but it's not someone I would describe as. Oh, maybe I shouldn't say this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This has not been digitally altered. However, I'm not ruling out some random person breaking into the house. Context on the video. My friend took this while pre-gaming for a night out. The, takes, the video takes place on an older house on Clemson camps, campus, and the two roommates are playing a ring on a string game while drinking. As the ring swings, you can briefly see a figure in a pink nightgown striding out of frame in the hallway. Yeah, um, if someone broke into the house, they wouldn't be wearing that. No, yes. and they wouldn't be that short. Well, unless they were a child. Ch do children break into houses often? Oh, I did. Well, you say Victorian ghost child, <laughs> General Hag, it's not, who knows? Sites. It was just okay, a, a little child in a dress. Yeah, we all broke into construction sites, junkyards, yeah, yeah, graveyards. Yeah, that's where I made my first love. Construction Con site? Yeah, me and the guy with the jackhammer. I love Rodney. <laughs> I love what he did to me. <laughs> um, yes. <laughs> well, oh, yeah, it's Shayla Hoden. I've seen ghosts. My great-grandfather loves fucking with my family. There was no ghost. What are you talking about? You fucking don't know. You're sitting in your ass. Next one. I appreciate the skepticism. Yeah. It's fine, but I actually do like that video. I think it's very. I think it's a good video. It's a great video. Now let's watch. This is another piece of UFO material. Which one's this one? All right, this is a good one. Here's another good one. This is fucking this old time. This is again. This is Zeri. Salamanca. Salamanca. Okay. Okay. Beaming down. It does take a second. There's another one. They all take a second. Each one of these take a second. Why don't they just start with the goosh? Because they gotta find it. A lot of times it's they see it, then they gotta find it, and then they gotta get it on the phone. And a lot of times it's looking for a place to park. You're looking for a thing to go. Like, believe me. Just edit. It's it's a thing. You actually you won't see the whole thing. This. You have the power when you send the stuff to James. You can send. I ain't got this kind of time. I can't edit each one of the videos down. You could give time. You codes. did ask me to edit some specific videos, and not, and not not this one. But not this one. <laughs> <laughs> well, because you gotta see. A lot of UFO people want to see the whole fucking thing, so that they know that it's not just a CGI. They want to see you discover it. Look, this is do dos minutos después. This is dos minutos. All right. So some people, if there is, you know, just the guy going I, 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 uh, for two minutes, that's what makes it real to them? Yes. Literally, Literally yes. Not, but if there's not a guy fumbling around with a bad camera angle, then... Yeah. Kelly, how many people are watching? <laughs> 420! 420! 420! Yeah, man! Here we go. We Look at this guy poop. You're wasting 420 people's time. 426. <laughs> okay, oh, is that... It's nothing. A lightsaber? It looks like it's a, a... It's a fucking... It's a it lightsaber. looks like a sonic screwdriver from you know, Doctor Who. At some Who. point, if you guys are never going to have fun with it, then you're never going to have fun in your life. <laughs> I have fun. <laughs> this is constantly. very interesting. This is extremely no one, interesting. I don't know anyone else in my life who has more fun than Ed. That's <laughs> <laughs> well, because he, he's got to watch more videos. He's got to yeah. watch more videos. This is this um, is fucking sweet. If you don't think this is sweet, like you can't like any single UFO video. Really? Yeah. This is fucking awesome. Why is it? It seems it's like rotating. It's, it's a weird. It's it's a UFO. It's UAP. <laughs> it's acting weird. It's just, it's like a rod. Yeah. It's called a UAP, bro. It's, this is the uh, this is in the uh, what do you call it? Cigar shaped category. Yes. The cigar shaped UFO is a big oh. UFO category. Oh, yeah, okay. that might be your vape, Janet, but not here. This is nineteen. This is before they had that tech. Yeah, it looks like a battery charger. Oh, so this is an old video. Yes. And you can see the weird blinking off of it from the light. That's what's fucking awesome. God, I want to And see it's a solid size. picture. It's a solid one. I was trying to. I was trying harder for you, idiots. Imagine the size. <laughs> of I literally the alien. was going through it. I was trying to find <laughs> solid fun. stuff. I mean, that was fun. That's was, a real video. That was solid. It was. It looks solid. It is solid. You're being too nice. <laughs> no, you're not being. At some point, we have to meet somewhere close. At some point. I, I like no. That was a long time ago, Matoko 104. I, that wasn't Elon's. That wasn't an Elon structure. I li I liked it, Henry. Thank you. I liked it. I did. Now this next video is another example of what's not UAP. Now this is not UAP. Okay. This is the opposite. No. This is a phenomenon I found online of frozen birds. <laughs> this shit's also very strange. Bird is trying to fly, but it's stuck. 
Oh shit, the America stuck in time. Look, no lie, bro. Is windy? I have what no idea. I looked at a bunch of different theories online. One was that it might be that it's windy, that it's extremely windy, and that the bird, but they were some saying that birds tire out. They fall from the sky when it's like that. That's when you see that. That's why they die during like tornadoes and hurricanes. There's also some people thought it was like stuck on some form of, there was a thing called like, like a, a net. There's a thing that they say in uh, Orthodox Jewish communities, which I don't know. I don't, again, oh, great. immediately, as soon as I saw that word, Jewish boundary wires, I was like, what? Because it was like a whole thing about, <laughs> Jew, I read this whole thing about Jewish fucking boundary wires that they send around a neighbor. I was like, I don't know. And then I was like, I was like, I'm back in the bad internet where it was like talking about, was the bird caught on this this wire that's supposed to denote the, the Evil Orthodox Jewish, Jewish wire? That I don't think is, I don't think that's real either. But there's all this weird shit because it obviously wasn't caught on anything. It was like, because it wasn't bouncing back and forth. It looks like it's just frozen in the air. And I found hundreds of those videos. There's, hundreds of those? Yes. I, I have more to show. <laughs> more bird videos? Like, yes. I want to see another one like right now. Yeah. Yeah. That's, we're going to wait. Yeah, this is we're very gonna compelling. There. We're going to get there. But, but yes, but that's I've not. I've seen birds like when it's really windy, just like coast. Yeah. Yes. Know, in but one I've place. never seen this. I've now but they were, that was flapping. Yeah. Yes, it was yeah, flapping. Was and I've seen a couple of, of versions of this. Yeah. yeah wind the hovering. wind hovering where it flies in a wind current at the same speed as the wind, causing it to appear to hover. For yeah. example, kestrels use wind hovering, but that's still moving forward. It's no, still. I've seen them just in one spot. Do up they in the just, hills? Yeah. I've never seen no, but for that long. Hawks hanging and moving. Their wings. That bird looked distressed. It looked yeah. weird. It looked like it was caught. It looked like it, it was why. tied to the pole by yes. its tail or some shit. But yeah. it wasn't going back. But oh, a roof. Thank you, shoe paste. It's called in a roof. It's the metaphysical city wall so they can go out on the Sabbath. That's what they do. But they're saying mm. birds are getting caught on it. I don't think that, I feel like that's where you're going to get a boatload of trouble saying that, oh, wow, we got to be careful for these bird destroying Jews. <laughs> All right, because I don't think they deserve that. All right, I don't think that they deserve that because honestly, their incredible use of chicken fat is wonderful. I love schmaltz in a nice matzo ball soup. We got to go to a carnival. You're gonna love it there. I love it. Yeah. Yes, kestrels can. Schmitty says yes, kestrels can hover like that. Okay. Yes, kestrels can hover. Like that. that can hover like that. So That's weird. what you sound like. <laughs> when you say it like that, when you go, uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. that's literally what you say. Are you making fun of people who yeah. pay for the show? Yeah, always. Fuck them. Yeah, good idea. Here we go. This next one. <laughs> this is a good one. Now, this was filmed over Cuba. This is a good one. Are they allowed to have cameras? I actually don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this was filmed in 2019. They must have smuggled it in. All right, this one's fucking really weird, too. This one's one that I can't find a proper explanation for what it is. It di first again. Hey, it's this a glowing looks very light. cool. This is weird ass glowing light. It looked like this no, one of those. I feel like I could mean, end up so being cool. some weird Elon Musk thing or some kind of private tech or something weird because it's whatever following. that thing is fucking really strange. That this, looks really cool. And That's I looked cool it up looking. too because I looked up LED kites. How much are they? They're not bad. I kind of want one. I feel like you need one if you're going to do any more of these prank videos. Show, but is this the Havana <laughs> syndrome? Could we do more of that? Can we make a... That's what we got to do. Is we got to make our own sighting. Yeah. yeah. We got to do this. We're going to create a misinformation series. But this is really <laughs> strange. I don't know why. I just don't know what it is. And it's again, cool. I tried to... What I did this time is I did want to go through the ones that would not take too much imagination. So I try to go and find the, like, I look through and try to find reasons of what the hell it could fucking be. And that one was another one where it's like, it's just extremely solid. Yeah. And everyone, you know, so I don't know. Yes, Big Herb, that is the wheel in the sky that Journey sang. Hell yeah. Wheel in the sky keeps on turning. It's Dude, turning can you burden. do fucking Journey for No Dogs? No. Why? Why? Why would he do Journey? Why would I do Journey's Journey? awesome. He picks cool bands. Yeah. You don't think Journey's cool? No. Journey's not good. Journey sucks. Yeah. Journey's awful. His Journey bad. Journey's good. They are. The He's lamest. got great pipes. I'd rather listen. That was to Bon Jovi. That was when singers yeah. were singers. So would I. No, no, no. Jerry, Jerry, fuck. What's his name? What's his name? Steve Perry. Steve Perry. Perry. Also, and he's the, an asshole, though. Of course, he's an asshole. He got replaced by a cover band singer. Yeah. <laughs> That's sad that they couldn't bring him back. Oh wow. Uh uh. God, 
journey. No. Come on. Come on, for me. Every single one of those guys looks like a different kind of pain in the ass. They oh, are. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Every flavor of pain in the ass. Yes, 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 yes. You got the guy who won't stay, uh, who won't leave. Right, that, that's the guy, the guy at the very far left. That's the guy who very much just stays in your home uh, after long after he told you he was moving to another town. You got the other guy who's fucking your girlfriend. Dexter. You got the other guy who's fucking your boyfriend. You got the other guy that is fucking, yeah, that guy is siphoning Wi-Fi. I can see the land along the long here siphon and wi-fi and the other guy's hanging outside the show and he's to see if he could dumpster dive yes what really made it worse was glee you're right ghost come right what made it worse was like in the early oh, yeah. 2000s let's put up a poll if journey's really... good no, let's put up a poll see what the be... audience thinks of journey's good i think everyone thinks journey's lame i don't know yeah they're lame who knows i'm not saying that they're not lame i'm just saying they're fun Here's another example. So this next one. This is what the first one might have been, or the one that we did not understand. So this next one is a series of this guy collected a series of what he calls footage of plasmoids. I like that. Now, these are plasmoids. This is what, I don't know if it's a thing that he's coined. I don't know if it's a term he's coined, but it's the idea of, like, these are just what I think a lot of what we might end up coming out as being UAP, which is natural atmosphere, atmospheric phenomena that is just, we just don't know what the fuck it is. Yeah. And that ball we just are lightning. not there yet. Ball light, Types of things that you'd call, like, ball lightning. So this is one. Yes, my mom keeps asking if you guys can see her. Oh my God, yes, you're dressed inappropriately. <laughs> I can't believe, ma'am, ma'am, I can see him. Now this is what he calls a plasmoid, which is just space gunk. It's some kind of sky is gunk. It dripping? I don't know. But he says that they, they are fast. He basically has a telescope pointed at 57% journey sucks. 57% 50, journey sucks. I've that's not too it, bad. I thought it was going to be worse. That's yeah. not too bad. Again, that's a Biden win. That's all he needs. See, look at this thing. It's like a fucking... It's a plasmoid. That's uh, really all there, there is to it. But, but it's but plasmoid. Says, but he says that's uh, a plasmoid. An, an atmospheric event. Thing. He's like, it's an atmospheric thing. Thing. Not event. It's an object. Saint Little's Helper says it's the powerhouse of the cell. Is that what they call it? I thought that was the, the mitochondria. mitochondria. It looks like a mitochondria. I think it's like, yeah. Oh, whoa. Does it? Whoa. I remember huh. them biology, They're dude. They're not popular it with traditional like, ufologists. You know, it looks but like no. one of those fire blankets or like those blankets, those tinfoil blankets the tinfoil. they put over people yeah. when, they get, when, they're after, when they're really cold or you think they're dying. It looks like one of those like falling out of a helicopter. It does. It's There's like, not much room to fit their scripted myths. myths and conspiracy theories. Yeah, this guy is very much a skeptic, which I'll take. I like these because this is one of those weird things of like, this is probably naturally occurring and we just don't know what it is. Some of it might be debris. Some of it might be, uh, again, just weird plasma shit that's floating around in the sky. I think that's a lot of what we see with the little tiny, like kind of amorphous orbs that are shooting around. I think yeah. a lot of that's just the planet Earth shedding bullshit. Yeah, I don't do know what it is. Like, kind of like maybe sometimes that when people think they see UAPs, it's almost like a mirage. Oh yes, utterly. You Absolutely. Know, like like yes. sometimes you're looking down the street when it's really hot and you can see like the air waves. Kinda. More than anything, and then they think that they this because the sky is like air is liquid right in its own way it's like super it is a it is a very very spacious liquid so maybe that it could work like that i don't know they say like, i don't know margo there's is there space trash this low i don't know i actually don't quite know uh do you ever feel like a plastic bag <laughs> <laughs> katie perry oh Yo, yeah this yeah this she's from my American taylor Beauty. swift i yeah. miss i think katie perry is better than taylor swift yeah, yeah and so I, I she's my yeah. taylor swift because she's hot quite a few people are you saying taylor that taylor swift. swift's not hot no wow she's an aryan like model of of weird kind of sallow pale skinny guy yeah it's gross she's technically kind of gross i think she's very attractive i think she's katie she's, perry's hotter i think she's yeah. nominally pretty in my way because because again i know all right look at me can yeah. we come back to me look at me yeah Ugh. <laughs> i wouldn't fuck taylor swift yeah <laughs> it's because you're married and you get divorced if you did I wouldn't even do it because I got taste. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> that is taste. Yeah. That is taste personified. 
I haven't seen taste like this in God uh, since, time, the last, since the last time I Dennis Rader gave an interview. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, now okay, so this is a good one. Here's another one. Is this is a good one? <laughs> yeah. All right, this is a good one. This is not UAP, but it's UAP adjacent. All right, uh, Heather B. Another question: What the fuck is a UFO evangelist as referenced in the caption at the top? Technically, me. There are people that are, which I could see the criticism. And you, ufology of people talking about it being a religion replacement, people looking at the aliens and UFOs as a new sort of belief system to make you feel better about the fact that we're all going to die and, and enter into total darkness and never experience anything ever again. And so I think and that, that's why there is the UFO evangelist edge, and I am sort of it. Spiral? Yeah, Taylor Swift is like gross is literally the embodiment of a bridge troll. Yeah, it's called, called irony. Yeah. <laughs> man, I just love how these UFO mandates, your defensiveness gets turned to fucking 20. Yeah. I, uh, technically, it's the bit, but it's also me. <laughs> <laughs> so this next one is Skinwalker. This is a Skinwalker, piece of Skinwalker footage. I wanted to, I, I, I might have shown this before. I don't remember. I just love it. So let's roll that beautiful half man, half wolf footage. All right. How do you Look, track them? Two more black dots. Cody. Oh, what the crap? Is that a guy? Oh, yeah, I've seen this. Yeah, yeah. you showed this like... Frick? I think I showed this. <laughs> you showed this. Because everyone's the guy saying, what the frick? Yeah, what the frick? Yeah, the yeah that's what it was. That's why yeah. I remember it was the what the frick. Yeah, because since they're in Utah... What the no. yeah. frick? Again? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He had his that mind blown, man. I think technically he has to go get five spanks from the, the, the head of dude <laughs> just for saying frick. <laughs> It looks like the guy who was in uh, House of a Thousand Corpses, Tiny. Tiny, yeah. Like, yeah. He's trying to like run it. into the bushes. I show that. All right. So that's. I, I, I thought I remembered showing that. That's fine. So I have more stuff. No chance that that's an alien? No. Well, skinwalkers are a weird sort of phenomena that's like somewhere between a spiritual thing, between some sort of natural entity mixed or an with black magic, or an interdimensional being. Hmm. It's Satan's little like, helper. That's the guy who just got caught fucking the animals. Yeah. <laughs> um, and apparently, you could just straight up date a horse. No, you can't. You know, one time I was uh, in Austin. I was uh, on this sort of nature trail. You know, me and a friend of mine were just kind of taking a little bit of a hike, you mm -hmm. know, just kind of get the air out. And I look up in the woods, and I just see two guys, totally naked, just walking. And I just saw him for a second. Like, there was a little clearing. Yeah. Those guys were up there in the woods, walking around naked, having a day. Oh, multiple Talk people. about freedom. <laughs> You're showing this again. People want to see this. Are you allowed people to People want to see it again. Woods? Or do you get in trouble? It depends. It depends on where you're at. All right, All right so you see these animals running. People want yeah. to see it again. Oh, what the crap? Is that a guy? He's too tall. The frick? Yeah, what the frick? Yeah, he didn't <laughs> say crap, too. Yeah, what the, what the crap? Creepy. Dude, that was a skinwalker. What? Follow him. Follow I videoed him. it. I videoed it. <laughs> what the frick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What the <laughs> frick? <laughs> that was a skinwalker. It's not good. No. What? That's Big Herb is not, you're honestly the brightest person I've seen so far. Dating a horse is legal as long as you don't fuck. Nothing stopping you from taking a horse out to dinner. Well, the horse, is, the horse can't pay. No, that's why it's a date. Yeah, you're taking. Otherwise, the horse it's out. just friends hanging out. You have to take. You have to pay if you want to take a horse out. Yes. You can't have a. You can't. A, See, a horse can't ask you out. This is the type of stuff that I love. Garbage sale. Was on tour once and saw a tall dog float across a parking lot in El Paso. It's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the kind of shit I love. I love the weirder the better, man. Um, what is that one? <laughs> yeah, 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 he said he saw a tall, a tall dog, dog float. float. Yeah. I don't know what that means. I across saw, the parking lot. I saw it. I saw it. I don't please, know. Please send more information. More, please. please. Yeah, 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 that's more. I saw a tall dog float. I don't know if that's a not name of a regional <laughs> ice cream dish. Someone threw... <laughs> Someone yes. from Juarez threw a dog over the yeah, wall. Yeah, let's. I want more information. Please. A tall <laughs> dog. What is a tall? A tall dog float. A tall dog float across the I don't parking know. lot yeah. in El Paso. Legs. All right, here we go. That's a tall. That's dog. A tall that's a tall dog. dog. But that's... Carmi's got long legs. No, she doesn't. Yeah, she does. You gotta look at her legs. Now this a next tall video. Ass dog right there. This next video is not UAP. Okay. It is not UAP. So that how we know. That's how you know what's not. Greetings from Mama Setting Sun and Baby Mohican Wolf. I have a 
very important video to make for you guys today. And I hope you have the time to watch and listen. So let's get into it. Oh, Ever since she day get one the on this out app, that I've baby. been sharing with you all my love and admiration and passion for Native American culture. I get that my ways of celebrating this culture is not traditional, is not what most of you do <laughs> to share your love and adoration for it. It is not what but we do. But I do it in my own unique and special way, and I am still trying to connect to my roots. And roots. all of these years, roots. I have endured your hate, your malice, your hostility, your anger, your wrath, your criticisms, your your unacceptable treatments because I do it differently than you because I have told you that I am part Native American She's and you Native have American. never believed me let's see the fucking no one paperwork is forcing you to make <laughs> videos you stupid fucking morons stop no one on your baby. is forcing any of you to fucking make videos and put them online no one is forcing you to do any of this i don't think you understand that you celebrate native americans differently marcus by i guess you put up a teepee in your home and you make wigwam out of various uh, dry macaronis and you give it out to your neighborhood. But others celebrate Native Americans in their own way. By putting on makeup on their baby and it's putting a videos out there? It's yeah. not even makeup. She didn't even celebration! commit that Celebration! Celebration time! She just did a damn filter. She didn't even paint. Oh, really? That's just a filter? And that's how you know she's Native American. How do you... She didn't actually paint herself? No. That, that was, was a filter. A, that was a filter. Oh, thank God. What is she... Celebrating how great Native Americans are with a filter. Yeah, and by talking about how she's the persecuted one Yeah, you I get this. it. I get persecuted every day. I'm too hot to work Garbage Hill says I couldn't see any legs <laughs> This is super serious. It was taller than that. I Don't know what that means still don't know what the fuck that means <laughs> So how is it tall? I don't know. If it he says I legs. can't see the legs. I don't know what that means. Legs are the you only gotta thing that makes more. a dog tall. I it need you to write like this out. A dog shaped balloon. Yes, I need you, you to write it out beat by beat by beat. <laughs> you were in a parking lot in El Paso you and just... a legless tall dog floated by. Well, now we know for a fact that that Native it's American. So <laughs> Oh, okay. that's cute. That's a cutie pie. Oh, you know, Frankie almost lost her leg, but they saved it. Oh, Aww. that's cute. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, but uh, yeah, tall dog. I saw a tall dog. I don't know. Floating. And we floating. need it. We need it to I'm be beaten back I know. Up. I'm just gonna be sitting like in my in bed at night and I'm thinking about a floating at the ceiling. Tall dog. I, I'm thinking, I saw a tall dog float across. It sounds like something that the fucking giant says in Twin Peaks. It does, yeah. I saw a tall dog I floating I'm across the park. I'm obsessed with the fact that you think it's tall and it doesn't have legs. Yeah, I, like I, I can't even get to the floating part in my head. I love this. I'm, deal I'm trying to deal with the fact that you think a dog is tall, but it doesn't have legs. So how could it be tall? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. No, I agree waist. with you. The legs yeah. are the what only makes something thing that tall. makes a dog tall. Unless it's got a long, 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 long waist. Oh, or does it, is a dog's height? A dog can you have, measure it long? If a dog doesn't yeah. have legs, do you measure a dog's height the long way? No, up to down. But if the dog that's is, length. All right, that's length. Let's ask a question. It has no legs. You put it normally then for it to hang out. It's got to go on its butt, right? Is that how it like you have to? Like so you would have to put it into a chair, right? <laughs> right. In my mind, well, that's what you do with a dog with absolutely no legs. You're not just gonna leave it on the ground like it's a loaf of bread. You're gonna prop it up, <laughs> so then the height becomes tail to fucking top of head. And then it's tall, right? No, that's like still. But yeah. what if you? But then it switches the height. Snout to tush is length. Unless tush is now bottom, yeah, and snout is if, now height. I, I, I actually, I'm on Henry's side on this one. I think if it's if it's sitting out, if it's like a worm dog, just like, yeah, like with no <laughs> nothing, <laughs> just ready to fucking live. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it should be killed for sure. No, it should be fed yeah. and kept happy as long as it's happy. <laughs> just put it in the yes, yard. you're right. Eight nickels. This is a serious mandate. 
Thank you. Has this guy answered? Yeah. It's, no. Has there been any follow up? No. He, he left. left the, he left God the chat. damn it! I can't fucking believe that you would do this in the middle of this. We all wanted this. I really like. We this wanted guy. the explanation. Can we? Can we it wasn't a shame. Patreon for free. No. <laughs> Can we? It's like, <laughs> for quitting. We're gonna give him things for free for quitting. A true like agent of chaos. <laughs> you I gotta, find you out. gotta respect. Someone I mean, track him down. That's a true Discordian, my friend. A true fucking Discordian. Someone uh, track him down. Uh, all right. So now this is. The next, this is a good piece of UAP footage. This next piece was released with the last UAP hearing. So this is actually okay. government, uh, quote unquote, approved. They say that they have not identified what's in this footage. See, I like that. Yes. So this is, it's not that interesting, but it's real according to the government. Okay. Let's see what they got. This is interesting. You'll see it uh, come through the top of the screen. There it goes. And then the camera will slew to follow it. Slew? Yeah, I don't know. That. Yeah, I guess that's the term. in and out of the field of view there. Only these guys can make this This is this essentially mm -hmm. all of the data we have associated with this event from some hmm. years ago. That oh, it looks thing. like a phantasm ball. Yeah. It does. It is going to be virtually impossible to fully identify that just based off of that video. That so is they, certainly now, what UAP, we can do and what we are doing. They don't know what this stuff is. keeping that as part of that group of 52% to see what are the similarities, what are the trends across all of these, do we see these in a particular distribution, do they uh, all cool. behave the same or not. As right, we yeah, get more boring. data... This guy's fucking more cut this guy. We will be it's able not, to. It's not good, <laughs> it's like this guy, but that is a... Is that, isn't that the, uh, the current head of ATIP? I believe, yes. Yeah, Dr. Kirk Patrick. Because well, the other yeah. guy said there was a guy that came out that was in charge of ATIP that wrote this long, very interesting article that says that, to be honest, they don't know what the fuck it is is going on in the sky. But the idea that we're like hiding things behind these various inner groups is ridiculous, according to him, because like we have the group. Like we have ATIP. We have these various things. You can go and technically there is an office now that you can go to. Mm -hmm. It just, I still think the major issue is they don't know what the fuck it is and they don't want to tell us that they don't know what the fuck it is. I think it's Roland Kirkpatrick. Maybe. I think his name is Roland. General Hag, garbage sales hitting his bong, watching the chat light up and wondering who garbage sale is. That's very funny. <laughs> it's very funny, but that's not, honestly, that's a memory problem. Yeah. This next one is not a UFO. Good. This is more plasmoid. I just wanted to show you more oh, plasmoid. another plasmoid? I just wanted to show you. You can look at it. What if the plasmoid was a UFO? It's just in the fucking... It's the same, it's the same video. I no, <laughs> it's different. It's plasmoid. It's just a different plasmoid. And what? There's no clouds in the sky? It's I a mean, plasmoid. I mean, I've seen... This is, it's weird. There's, there's plenty know. of times. It's weird as shit. All right, here. Ty Ransom. Henry, in a situation like this, if they fired a missile and hit the craft, how would you feel? My thing is, is that I think that any sign of aggression towards something we don't understand is a very, very bad idea. I don't think that if we don't know what it is, the first thing you should do is shoot a missile at it unless it's actively killing us. So yeah. I think yeah. that they, I for agree. them to shoot yeah. a missile at that is actually an extremely, extremely bad idea. Because if it got here and it's just checking us out, because I think that those little metal orbs, I think that's from something else entirely. I think that that's literally an example of an AI society. I think it's an example of some where a completely robotic like some form of thing that exists entirely as that and that that little ball is the alien itself and maybe it's on a fucking recon mission maybe it's like god knows what it's doing mm -hmm. all right yeah. here we go so that garbage shell got back garbage shell came back okay we can cut that we can cut the plus boy no one cares i was sitting in a car waiting for our show to start i was not drinking I and mean, i have been out of weed since leaving colorado oh completely sober completely bored the top half of the dog's body <laughs> floated across the parking lot of cars. I have never seen a dog so tall in my life. It wasn't moving like a dog and floated all steady and smooth like some sort of ghost. Our guitarist thought it was a skinwalker. I think it was the ghost of a tall ass dog. <laughs> <laughs> Which is not, I actually think both could be correct. Yeah. And that's a really interesting story. I like this yeah. story. Thank you for doing your best to explain uh, that. Yeah, I, thank you, Garbage <laughs> Dale. Okay, so the, we're going to give the, you something. Was, we should but, give him something. We should figure was out the, Was the dog upright or was the dog horizontal? It, it sounds horizontal. like it was doing it was like this. Just, it was like, yeah, it was just. <laughs> 
It was doing the thing. It was doing the. It's, uh, it's like the Nightmare on Elm Street dog, or the Nightmare Before Christmas dog. Mm. And there he goes, tall dog. Hey. <laughs> 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 is it garbage sale? Is this what happened? <laughs> Let us know <laughs> if this is a <laughs> accurate de- description. Of yeah. that. <laughs> I saw a very tall dog. Very tall dog float across the parking lot. All right, what's this next one? This is next video. No, this is UAP. This is UAP. I've got like five more. Videos. I think the soberness is maybe what made him see the dog. Who knows? September that's 11. what I'm saying. I think that it's soberness Ooh, 2009. is 2009. Okay. Yeah, oh. it's September 11, 2009. So it's not as fun. Raw footage, man. Fucking getting it. Yeah, no condoms. Coming inside us. All right. I was fucking with you. There's a jellyfish. <laughs> <laughs> There's a fucking. That is weird, right? Blinked out. <laughs> I just put a jellyfish in there to fuck with you. Because <laughs> I'm funny. <laughs> He's funny. He's a funny guy. <laughs> you know, if you hadn't told me it was a jellyfish, I wouldn't have guessed that it was a jellyfish. It's jellyfish. Huh. That, see, it looks like balloons until it disappears. That's what's weird. Until they didn't finish editing it. Well, you shows here, it got at these things where it shows how plump the image is. Do you know they can do a thing where it shows that it's plump? Mm. Oh. Contrast. They show that it's air, right? It's hanging in midair. It's fucking weird. Yeah. There's, there's stuff going behind it. Yeah, there's things floating around it. And then it just disappears. But they That's also the disappeared. All of the, everything This is the most serious I've ever seen Ed Mothman's wife says. Yes. Even the birds. But the thing is that there's just birds upset. flying around it, and the birds disappear at the same time that it does. Yeah. Yeah, it disappears. Also, but do the birds work for it? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> or are, is the it birds are, a part, are the birds a part of a field? Yeah, because there's are three those... of them. There's three birds. But are those and birds? And they disappear? Two of them just disappeared? Well, they just kind of flew behind the other side. I think those are planes. They just vanished, though. They vanished. Unless all it's all of part of the same they phenomenon. All... It has it to be like together. Actually... KNS watching the stream in the Caribbean on your honeymoon. Oh, be jamming. Have fun. Be... Have sex. Sex. <laughs> fuck. You got to fuck watching this. On your honeymoon? Start fucking now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. calm <laughs> now. Yeah, start fucking now. <laughs> Man, that's what we gotta do, dude. No one's ever fucked during the serious mandate yet. So if you can fuck right now, if you guys can get start, start going down in there right now, you start flipping around, do a big 69, that means what we have done here, we've sealed a ritual. Finally, somebody's getting laid over UFOs. I'm sure it's happened. Here's another example of what's not UAP. I don't know if it has happened. <laughs> I don't know if it has happened. This is another it example looks of like a floating a black bird. bird, but it's not moving. That's a dead bird, and it's just floating in the air. No strings, no nothing. He's not the only one who saw it. That's freaking weird, man. Isn't it? Yeah, like there's someone else taking a picture. Right. What the fuck, dude? It's a it's mystery leaving many people puzzled and questioning what could it be. General Hag says she fucks on ham dates. Like a wire, it can't. Okay. There's no way something that can just be floating in midair. Speaking of wires, could this be an Arab? Arab is a boundary that goes around a community. This guy. Jewish people are obligated to keep Sabbath. This is where I learned so about the Arabs. This boundary makes the area into a semi-private domain. This can be done by using a piece of string. And we'll often Big Herb put says on, I lost my virginity while watching the X Files. Does that count? No, because the X Files is sexy. Fox Mulder is sexy. So an Orthodox Anderson. synagogue confirms with Glacier Media that there are no Arabs in Surrey. Mm. The string there was much higher than we would use. Our strings are usually 10 to 20 feet off the ground. This exceeded 20 feet. Going over the that guy's top a rabbi? Of a very tall tree. Yeah. I guess. What an odd He's wearing an emergency vest. I did not what get an odd outfit for any man to wear. Bird. So you know he's coming. Environment and Climate Change Canada does not have any input on crows. The Ministry of Agriculture and Food cannot give a diagnosis without examining the bird. And BC Hydro says power lines would not cause something like this. Yeah, it's fucking weird, right? Let's have what the some hell fun is with that? it. Maybe it is a glitch in the matrix. Yeah, M- M- MX-16. Was this on the news? Do they not have murders and shit? Kingsbury. No, it's, like, it's Canada. Researches paranormal activity. That's the beauty of these paranormal uh, events that you can't rule out anything. All right, get this guy uh, out of here. I hate Paul Kingsbury. 
I this, hate him. <clears throat> this bird thing's real. This is serious. Yeah, it's weird, right? This is actually very compelling, <laughs> more than the UAPs. Yeah. It's, I throw, I, it's interesting. Would you throw a rock at it? Yeah. I'd throw a rock at it. I mean, it, it seems like it's dead. You got to get it down. I would throw, I yeah. would definitely throw a stick at it. Yeah. 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 Something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I want to see one real bad. I'd see a frozen one. Oh, yeah. Sonny says I think it committed suicide. The bird? Yeah. There oh, has yeah. to be a wire. Ah. Otherwise, how is it floating? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Kelly Slay, not going to lie, I did end up having sex during a rewatch of the Marcus Makeover. Oh, oh, wow. That does count. Well, that's great. Again, there was a lot of sex involved in that one, especially mm -hmm. the late type. Mar part. Marnie is asking if we're wondering if it does have something to do with magnetic fields and birds. I have no fucking idea. It's weird, though. There's a lot. Of, look up frozen birds. There's a bunch of them. You ever thought about how many people have had sex while listening to our voices? I think about it sometimes. Hey, you know what? All I can say is muzzle. Because if you can come while I'm going, then you're a real fucking woman. What's the most unfortunate thing you've had on in the background while you have sex? Total silence. Cryptic silence. That's unfortunate? Yeah, well, no. We don't do music in that way. I probably, um, but hereditary. Hereditary was playing in the background. There's something that has to, oh, hereditary? Yeah, but I love hereditary. I'll watch it. I just turned that on. I watch that like it's like I, I love that movie. <laughs> For me, I think it might have been a, a loop of the oh, whole Bernie, Did you really have sex during girl deliverance? Gurney. Oh, as, as long as wow. it's not that Gurney. one scene. During the yeah. Ned Beatty scene? Not during during yeah. the Ned Beatty scene? No. Oh. <laughs> right afterwards. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Fister says, I had a four-way during the movie Jaws, and my friend wouldn't stop quoting the movie while he was banging out this chick. Wow. wow. We're going to need a bigger dick. <laughs> <laughs> I once had an extended period of sex with the um, the DVD menu of Who Framed Roger Rabbit playing over and over oh. again. I think I've seen more DVD menus playing than whole than music. Or that that that's common. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, Don Rickles for me, by the way. <sighs> During a Don Rickles. Uh, yeah, anyway, <laughs> we're, we're yeah we're watching a bunch of videos and sort of fooling around, and then you know the videos keep playing. Yeah. God, ew. Ew. Oh, you hockey puck. <laughs> See if I can come all over yourself. <laughs> hey, now, all right, here's another good one. It's good. We got. I want to get through the rest of these videos. We start to late. Let me do this. I love this channel. This is really good. Every day I go out to see the sky for a few minutes, and today I saw a dark spot. The dumb shit Henry someone... says, I just joined for my first live chat, and I'm so confused. Welcome. Is someone playing tuba? They gotta call it. He's loving his life. <laughs> Someone's doing their scales. Yeah. <laughs> I like this. It's better than this channel does really good because it doesn't put the stupid like music behind it. Yeah. This is the one. I should have deleted the other one. This is the really, really, really good spinning one. Well, yeah. I mean, mm. <laughs> is it spinning? <laughs> it is spinning. <laughs> What's that big thing in the background? It's a dish. Oh, it's a satellite dish. Yeah, a satellite dish. Oh, okay. This is gonna... <laughs> Let's have a closer look. All right. Let's, have, have, a, let's have a closer look. listen. See, that's, this is the one I meant to show. This is the one I meant that was actually very, very good. Because you can see that thing's fucking spinning. You can see it spinning? Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. None of these guys... That one's fucking camera. weird. Yeah, I can I can see a spin. Now, is it moving or can he not hold the camera? He can't. He's following it in the sky. It's well, moving through the sky. Well, the more you zoom in, the harder, harder it is, is to catch yeah. it. Well, harder, harder, harder to catch it is it. to keep it stabilized. Yes. Eight nickels. So the question isn't whether there are aliens on Earth. It's whether the government has contact. I actually think that that is an that is the actual question. Whether or not. It is true that the intelligence agencies have been slowly, kind of vaguely signaling towards that we had some form of contact with something that was non-human and that we have something that is non-human somewhere in a hangar. I think that that is the big secret is that we have a thing and they why don't know what the fuck Why not give it back? Is. Because they, because to give it, why did we probably don't know where the fuck it came from or what it does. They're saying they've been trying to retrofit stuff out of UFO technology and maybe they just can't get anything out of it and they've been wasting billions of dollars and, and have this thing in a hangar and they don't know what the fuck to do with it. This next thing is an example of what is not UAP again. 
<laughs> yep, it's brown. Brown that- out. Brown. Oh, out. she she's wearing a diaper. Getting big and brown. <laughs> oh, is she Wink. winking or is she missing <laughs> an eye? <laughs> winking. Oh, oh, oh right in there. Rude. Oh, oh, Penny Lane, if we considered a flying Dutchman type phenomenon. I yes, I think all things can and are true. Uh, and I think do I have one left? You got one more UFO or not? Right? I got one more UFO. <laughs> I got one more UFO. All right, yeah. All right, here we go. They would say, Heather B., Henry at the UFO con- con- convention, do a demonstration on how to take a video on a smartphone. That's actually really funny. Yeah. Because what we could do is have you be the UAP. I'll be a UAP for you. He's also going to do during the, we're going to have a little bit of a Q&A section. We might have an alien visitor. A visitor, yeah. I'm excited for Contact in the Desert. You guys got to come. If you're in the area, if you're lonely close, come check it out. We're going to have a blast. Apparently, this shit gets litty faux shitty. Yeah. It's supposedly very nice. Yeah, but people get fucking railed in there. Mm -hmm. You just said people don't get railed. Well, this is different. When you're in this this area, I was talking to the guy who took because it's very like. These are people like, it's it's better than, it's not a comic convention. It's people who believe they are or have met aliens. Mm Mm-hmm. And but some then of them, there's fans of aliens oh, yeah. as well. But guess what? Some of them put out. Yeah. Let's do this next one. They fuck an alien. They fuck anybody. It's right? small airplane, but there's no sound. Maybe it's one and of he can those be a tall dog, Satan's a little bro. All right, so this is like you kind of see it in the sky. Can you go to the one that's a close up one? This is this weird fucking thing that looks like the entire. It looks like that the looks bottom. Like a mirage. It looks like the bottom of a invisible craft. That it's like it weird does. Lights. That one looks pretty cool. It's I like weird. The, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's no tall dog. But. No, <laughs> nothing is. And what I wish I, I need, we need to make this footage. We yeah. need to make the tall dog. I saw a tall dog floating across a parking lot no in legs. El Paso. I feel like that's a beginning of a like a Towns Van Zant song. I saw mm. a tall dog. No, no, never see it again. Well, this was my very serious UFO mandate. I think we learned a lot about what is UAP, what is not UAP, how to open your mind, how to close your mind right up. And I think that's really good. I think that's the best we can do. Guys, final thoughts. You know, it's the weirdest thing. I think we I mentioned it earlier, and the more I learn about UFOs from you, the more I realize if they do exist, who cares? I think that that's actually a very important lesson because I asked how I got over my we are in a simulation problem because for a long time I was very fixated in the idea that we might be in some hologram and eventually I began to realize, but does it matter then? Yeah. It's a really solid simulation and I can't seem to break out of it no matter what I do. Mm-hmm. Marcus? Marcus? Just waiting for more tall dogs. Hey, yeah. we all are. I mean, that's what I'm going to be. That's what I'm waiting, waiting on a tall dog. That's okay. going to be the name of my biography. Mm-hmm. That's all he waiting wants to Waiting on a tall see. dog and by Marcus J. Parks. <laughs> a life <laughs> in podcasting. Hey, and Curtis says, the problem with these videos, I can never tell if my screen is dirty or the spots are what Henry is excited about. Hey, join the club, buddy. Because you never know. All right? Yeah, Morgan says, I love these mandates, but I'm exhausted at the end of them. Yes. Mm-hmm. As am I. You know why? As of all of us. Because the truth is spiritually, mentally, physically draining. So, you're welcome. And I hope you don't get arrested tonight fighting the government. Hail Satan. See you next week. Here, boy. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. This dog is short. Yeah. <laughs>